Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hey everybody. It's Brock. This is Brock. And we got a new episode with another episode of All About. Of All About. All About. What's up everybody? It's Brock and it's Thursday and we got a good old fish video today. It's going to be all about the Scopus Tang. Almost like an emo yellow tang. So prices on these guys, you'll spend about 30 bucks on them tank size they say on the internet you need like 125 which would make sense if they got to their max size but they take a long time to grow so for me i'd recommend like a 75 care level they are moderate which normally tends to raise the bar because they have a specific diet you got to feed them algae temper they are semi-aggressive they are tangs i mean they're gonna be the king of the tank so just watch out for that reef compatible yes great reef fish temperature you want to keep it 72 to 78 dkh 8 to 12 ph 8.1 to 8.4 and your salinity 1.020 to 1.025 max size they say they can get a foot long i mean i would love to see that and that is huge colors they have that nice black to tans a little bit of yellow in there diet they are a herbivore like i said make sure you're feeding them algae a lot i mean i feed mine algae every single day and I normally recommend people to get the green sea veggies. They just seem to like it the most. Compatibility, just ask. Leave a comment down below. And origin, they do come from Fiji. So normally you don't put them together with other tangs. People say they have problems getting together. But you never know. Every fish is different. Everyone has a different personality. So you could try it out. Just make sure to add them in at the same time. And another thing about tangs, you know, if you don't have a UV sterilizer on your tank, you might want to invest in getting like a cleaner wrasse or a cleaner shrimp to run around and be cleaning them up as they're going through their life because tangs are going to get sick at times and you just can't do nothing about it. Your tank can be perfect and they can get it. So definitely if you get a tang, get one of those if you don't have a UV on your tank because UVs are really expensive. Most people don't have one. So I recommend getting one of those. And that's it for the Scopus Tang. I hope you'll have a good day, and I will see y'all next week.